Royal Caps. I'm Rari and, and I'm Connie. And welcome to the season finale of my TV. TV. Please stand, stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. allegiance. Place your right hand over your heart. Ready, begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for the Whittier Wildcat Pledge. Ready, begin. I am a Whittier scholar. I am respectful. I am responsible. I am safe. I always do my best and I strive for excellence. Here's the last Ready Wednesday of the year. Hey guys, it's Mrs. Brees here with the last Ready Wednesday for the school year. So we're going to get right to it. Remember that when I show the word, you're going to rate yourself on this rubric. One, you don't know the word. You've never even heard it before. Two is you've heard the word. A three is I can tell what the word means. And a four is I can explain this word to someone. So this is the word strive. Strive. We say this word every day when we recite our wildcat pledge. Strive. So I, you're at least a two. What do you think this word means? Lock in your rating. And let's talk about it. The word strives, here are some synonyms or words that are similar, it means to attempt, to try, to plug away. In fact, when I was looking for, looking up synonyms for this word, a lot of the words involved work like labor or dig away or plug away or exertion, which tells me this word strive means we're going to have to work really hard. So here are some, def here are some words that define phrases or words that define to try hard. And that doesn't mean just trying hard one day and saying, okay, I did it. It means it's persistent. It's consistent. You do it over and over again to strive. Another way to define strive is endeavor. Endeavor means that you're going to attempt to achieve something. You're going to work really hard to achieve something, a goal. So those are very similar to strive. And then serious determined effort. So this is serious stuff. When we are talking about striving or we want to strive for something, it's a goal that we set and it's something that we really want to work hard to achieve. So one of my goals for this summer is I want to learn ASL, American Sign Language. I think it would be a really fun thing to do. It would be a great way to um, communicate if I need to with people who use that language. And so my daughter and I are going to take a class together. We're going to strive to learn a new language. We're not just going to do it once. We're going to work really hard. We're going to attempt to achieve a goal. Our goal is to learn how to speak or you uh, speak ASL or use um, um, ASL in communication. So that'll be interesting. I'm wondering if I know summer is a time for us to kind of relax a little bit and, and take a break from the structure of school but there's also time for you to strive to meet a goal. So I'm wondering what that goal might be. It could be a personal goal. It could be something that you're wanting to better yourself in, like a sport or a music. Personally, it could be, you know, I would love it if you said, I'm going to read every day. I would love that. And Mrs. Johnson would love it if you said, I'm going to practice my math facts every day. But... So you can say that and you can set a goal. I really want you to strive for whatever you do. If your goal is to relax, then I want you to strive and work hard to relax. Okay. It's been a great year. You guys, I've loved being able to be part of Whittier and I'm just so thankful that we um, get to communicate together and I'm hoping that we continue to do this next year. I hope you have a lovely, lovely summer. See you soon. Thank you for watching the season finale of WeTV. And as we say goodbye to the fifth graders, we hope they have an amazing time. I hope with, I, we hope WeTV is as fun for the fifth graders next year as it was for us this year. Have a beautiful day and enjoy the last season, the season finale of What's a Weird coming up right, right now. now. <laughs> <laughs>